You've heard of the most interesting man in the world and the new most interesting man in the world, but they've got nothing on the most interesting man in the universe! Going into outer space, there's only been a handful of African Americans who've been there. 16. Yes, it's astronaut Leland Melvin, and here's why he's so damn interesting. He started in the 80s, he was a professional football player. He tore his hamstring, so his football career ended. So Leland had to rely on his fallback career, astronauting. Was he on the shuttle? Yes, he's, he went up twice. How else do you get to space? A couple of rom-coms and a green screen. Anyway, tell us about being an astronaut, Leland. Out of 550 people in the universe that have flown in space, well, maybe not universe, in the world that's flown in space, I am one of 16 African Americans who flown. He's logged over 500 hours in space. God, I love this guy. And it gets even better. And I was actually in space the first time with two African American men, okay. myself and Dr. Bobby Sasher and Tom Joyner interviewed us in space and Sybil calls us the Afronauts, so we had Afronauts in space. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> He's pretty happy about that. Oh my God, I love this guy. This guy's bigger than Ron Popeil. Yeah, being one of the first black men to leave the Earth usually puts you above the set it and forget it guy. Plus, Leland just wrote a book. This is the cover of his new book, Him with His Dogs. <laughs> Chasing Space with Leland Melvin. Adorable. I wonder if he asked if he could take his dogs into space as like an emotional service pet or something, <laughs> but they'd let him. They come out of a van with a dog with a, with a, um, the vest on. <laughs> Those vests work every time. The helmet helps too. Thank you so much, man. Thank you. Thank you man. Bye -bye. We're TMZ. If you like our vibe, click on that button and hit subscribe. We'll send you more.